Wanna get rich? Make an app! Mark Zuckerberg made Facebook and now he's like a bazillionaire. I am buying VampireCaveman.com No, stop! We don't have time to make these apps. We're too busy making YouTube videos. But Vampire Caveman would be the best app ever! I know! That's why we're gonna make someone a millionaire today! Number 8! Stranger Book! Are you annoyed with Facebook because your friends' posts make you realize all your friends are idiots? Then join Stranger Book, the social media app where nobody knows each other! It's great! You start connected to everyone on the planet. But if you interact with anybody, it removes them from your stranger network. I just poked 50 people off my stranger list! Isn't it great? Actually, I'm incredibly lonely. Stranger Book. Only slightly more lonely than Facebook. Number 7! A mishmash! There are dating apps for all kinds of people. J-Date, Christian Mingle, Farmers Only. It's time the Amish had their day! Actually, AmishDating.com already exists. But we're gonna do one better for our Lincoln bearded boys. Amish Match makes finding eligible Amish singles that much easier. When the Amish are finally ready to embrace technology, they can simply swipe left on the phones they don't use yet to pass up Isaac and Abraham to find that special Samuel. Number 6. Wing Zingers. Are you a Democrat? Are you a Republican? Do you have a point to prove but don't actually know anything? Okay. I'm with wing zingers. Simply type in whether you're right wing or left wing, and a fake news story is generated for you. Okay, we'll try left first. Wing zingers. See? It says all the bees are dead, and that Michael Moore said so. What will it say if I say I am right wing? Rush Limbaugh's photograph of Obama crapping on his lawn. Wing zingers. Number five. Airbnb. You let strangers come into your house and use your toilet! No wait, we gotta explain what it is first. Human beings have basic needs and there are apps to help. With Uber, you give somebody a ride. With Airbnb, you give someone a place to sleep. And with Airbnb... You let strangers come into your house and use your toilet! You want to tell them what P and P stands for? No, oh, you could do it. <gasps> P and Poo! No! It's porta potty! Number 4. VampireCaveman.com Okay, truth be told, we don't know what to do with this. It's just an amazing combination of words. And it is available! It could be a dating site for vampires who find cavemen attractive. Or it could be a website dedicated to Washington Capitals hockey star Alexander Ovechkin, who looks both like cavemen and vampire! See? The possibilities are endless! We should buy it! No, I told you, we're too busy. We're not even done making this video. I bought it. You did what? Number three, unlinked. I don't remember even signing up for LinkedIn, and I get like seven emails a day from it. Unlinked is the opposite of LinkedIn. It is social networking for unemployed people. This is the app for you if you want to feel good about having no job. When I'm playing Call of Duty at three in the afternoon with no shirt on, I love it when I get an email like this. Check out Greg's new skill! He made scrambled eggs for six hours today! Number two, the whole shebang. Meal kit apps, they are all the rage. They send you meat and some other stuff and directions on how to cook the meat and the other stuff. The whole shebang goes way deeper than that. On Monday, you send a live hog, which you have to kill and bleed and butcher. 60 stalks a week, which you get to grind down to make flour, to make bread, and seeds, to grow vines, to grow grapes, to turn into raisins, to put in your bread pudding. Each meal costs $7,000. Livestock changes weekly. And the number one app we would love to make if we had time, but we don't, so you should make it? I miss grandma! Is your grandma too far away and not around no more? This app connects you to a random old folks home and you can talk to an old person for as long as you want. And the best part is, you can hang up if you get bored and the old person will be automatically connected to another user. And they won't even know the difference. Because they're old. 